Buoyancy control. Buoyancy control is a critical skill taught to enable the diver to establish positive, neutral, and negative buoyancy. This allows the diver to control his position in the water column using a buoyancy compensator. Seated neutral buoyancy. Once directed by an instructor, begin in the seated position with legs crossed Indian style. Begin holding the power inflator in your left hand, forming an L shape with your pointer finger on your manual dump valve and your thumb on your power inflator button. Ensure all air is dumped from your buoyancy compensator. Next, you will begin adding air to your buoyancy compensator in small short bursts. Repeat this step until neutral buoyancy is established approximately 3 feet off the bottom of the pool. If too much air is added, utilize the manual dump valve overhead and dump air accordingly and reattempt neutral buoyancy. Prone neutral buoyancy. Once directed by an instructor, begin in the prone position. Begin holding the power inflator in your left hand. Ensure all air is dumped from your buoyancy compensator. Next, you will begin adding air into your buoyancy compensator in small short bursts. Repeat this step until neutral buoyancy is established. The goal of this evolution is to establish neutral buoyancy and pivot on fins approximately 1 to 3 feet off the bottom. Getting familiar with the effects that inhaling and exhaling has on your buoyancy. Swimming with neutral buoyancy. Once directed by an instructor, begin in the prone position. Start by holding the power inflator in your left hand. Ensure all air is dumped from your buoyancy compensator. Next, you'll begin adding air into your buoyancy compensator in small short bursts. Repeat this step until neutral buoyancy is established. The goal of this evolution is to establish neutral buoyancy and swim one lap at waist level and one lap head level off the bottom of the pool. While swimming laps, the student is required to maintain the power inflator and depth gauge in their left hand. This allows a familiarization of depth awareness while swimming the required laps. If during this evolution the diver adds too much air to their buoyancy compensator, the diver will be expected to utilize the proper dump valve appropriate for the horizontal dive position.